Hey everybody, welcome to Rock and Dust at the Flicks. I'm the Gold Dust. This is the Rock Star. All right, today we're going to be talking about the Avengers, which I thought was an awesome movie. Uh, they've been building it up for a while. They had Iron Man, the Hulk, then came Thor, and finally the Captain America movie, which led up to the Avengers, the film itself. And uh, we had the bad guy Loki, which I thought was a pretty good character for them to start it off with, because it actually is official in the comic books. Um, what did you think about the movie, Rob? I was excited to see it until they didn't show, I realized they didn't show Wolverine enough. Wolverine only showed up once or twice, and that made me upset. Alright, Wolverine I like was that. actually, wasn't actually in the film, but uh, yeah, but we had the Hulk, Thor, Captain America, Black Widow, Hawkeye, Iron Man, those characters didn't strike you to be. No, they, they the didn't movie, no. was better. Well, okay. Unfortunately, they only showed him twice. Two or three well, times. Well, in the film, say. they were uh, actually after the Tesseract, or in the comic book, they actually called the Cosmic Cube, for those who know actually about the comic book itself. So, um, they kept it pretty true to the comic, in which I thought the action and the pace of the film was good, the way they floated, the characters fighting, and actually uh, continuing, continuing the fight scenes from one character to the other, from Black Widow to Captain America to Thor and to Iron Man and Iron Man actually getting caught by the Hulk, sliding down the building, ripping the whole building up. It's awesome. So, I mean... That was okay, but it was just too much going on, you know. The kryptonite, which affects Superman, why was it affecting Wolverine and why was it affecting the Avenger Man? That didn't make sense to me. That, that To me, that was stupid, you know. The Avenger Man and the the Kryptonite that goes together. You actually didn't see the movie, did you? No, actually I did. I did. Okay. Well, like I said, Iron Man, the Hulk. I thought they were the best characters of the film. Some uh, other characters like Hawkeye really didn't make too much of a big impact in the film to me. Neither did the uh, Black Widow. I mean, all these superpowers, most of the individuals. I mean. Although keeping true to the comic, but at the same time, still, I think they should have kind of left them a little bit smaller parts, but they played a much bigger role for the film. And uh, overall, like I said, it was a good movie. And um, I liked when Baby Hulk was there. Because when Baby Hulk was like, when he was, they showed him when he was like 12, 13, he was good. That, I wish they would have kept him as Baby Hulk throughout the whole movie. Because Baby Hulk is the truth, you know? He's, okay. He gets it in. All right, so that was the Avengers this week on the Rock and Dust at the Flicks. I'm the Gold Dust. This is the Rock Star. See you next time at the Flicks. This is the Gold Dust the movie Avengers. I give it to Rick James. Yeah. This is the Rock Star, and the movie The Avengers. I give it a Millie Vanilli.